Lacey Swope, Speaking 946. Exactly. We need some <laughs> sweetness <laughs> in here. Yeah. That's oh our Valentine my. to you. That was the nicest thing Storm has ever said. You're to welcome. Me. That was so <laughs> kind. He's gonna Today make is the it. day of love, and he had to at least hear it out. The show is winding down. Had to throw in a little one-liner. Thank you so much. Mostly sunny skies, bright sunshine on our Lucky Star Sky Cam Network. We are dry today. We're looking dry over the next several days across Oklahoma, but we're already above average for the year for 2024. You remember January was a wet month, 1.8 inches of rain. The green is the moisture that we've had. The blue is average, and typically, if you just look here, January and February on average are some of our wettest months, along with November and December. But we were above average in January. Already in February, we've had over an inch of rain. We've had 2.9 so far. And as we work our way closer to spring, of course, the jet stream pattern becomes more active. Our rainfall rates get higher. We get those thunderstorms to occur, and we usually end up with more water. But we're sitting pretty in the drought department, that's for sure. We still have snow lingering in Caddo County from that storm system Sunday into Monday. When you look down from space, the black on the map is where you're seeing the ground, but you see the white? That is the snow still reflecting the light back up to satellite imagery from Gracemont to Anadarko, back just south of Fort Cobb. There's nowhere Oklahoma. Great place to be there just south of the lake. All the way back along Highway 19 from Apache, still snow. And overnight, we've been getting these uh, refreezing situations. We're still a few isolated slick spots, but it's very localized where those higher bands set up and still unfortunately about 500 to 600 customers without power to the southwest where some of that heaviest snow has fallen that number's getting better but it's not there yet Today, additional winds. It's a south wind, and then the cold front slams in later this evening and tonight. So here's what to expect on the wind front. 25, 30, 35 mile an hour gusts. They're already picking up by 2 o'clock today. 20, 30. That continues well into the afternoon, especially right through central Oklahoma. And then this evening and tonight, as the front pushes in, our winds relax a little bit. They start to pick back up some tomorrow, but they'll change direction. So it's not one of those days where the cold front slams in and it's awfully cold. It will be cooler than today. Today, the south wind, and there's the snow with the system. It's still a winter storm moving through for Nebraska, for South Dakota. But for us, it's bringing sunshine, it's bringing south breezes, and warmer temperatures. 45 currently on our Lucky Star Sky Cam Network. 48 in Mustang. It's 50 in Edmond. 52 in Shawnee. 54 in Chandler. 52 in Midwest City. And we'll see 40s to the north, already warming to the 50s in many areas. Upper 50s now in the southeast. Here are your live wind gusts. Every time I show this map, these numbers are increasing. So 15 to 20, 21 is the strongest wind gust we've seen, and that's been in Piedmont and Guthrie in just the last five minutes. We're getting gusts 20 to 25 into western Oklahoma as well. Hour by hour, 65 degrees with sunshine. Average highs are in the low 50s. We're above normal today. 65 in Piedmont, 67 Chandler, 67 degrees in pink. Upper 60s in the northwest as well as the south. So happy Valentine's Day in Enjoy it. If you've got big plans, you're going to be out on the town. Are you coming to downtown for a hot date tonight? Temperatures will be in the 60s, falling into the 50s, and your winds do start to back off. It's a busy graphic, but I feel like I can get away with it on Valentine's Day. We do have a storm system from the west coming in that's helping to crank up the wind. The next storm coming in from the northwest is bringing in Canadian air, and winter isn't done. It's still going to be, you're going to be reminded, it's still February by the time we get to the end of the week and the weekend. Enjoy the sunshine today. Tomorrow is a it's a cooler day. It's cold going into Friday and Saturday as it's kind of glancing blow arrives. Strong north winds. They relax some Saturday. We may have a little snow in the panhandle Saturday morning. It shouldn't amount to a whole lot. Then we rebound back into Sunday. Monday, we're dry, but a storm system approaches. will give us a bit more wind. And then 70s return to the forecast into next week. The Arctic air stays to the north. Now, tonight's the front, so we do get a wind shift. But we're in the 30s and 40s. It's not that much colder. 38 in Ponca, 47 in Ardmore, and then tomorrow, 50s are on the way, 60s to the south. Friday, 49 with that north wind. It'll feel cold. Wind chills in the teens Saturday morning, back to the 40s, and then 50s by Sunday. Lacey and Storm, back to you.